We attended uh, investment uh, conferences. We gave reports. We presented uh, a number of uh, papers in different meetings. Uh, we also had an opportunity together with, this, with the governor of Bank of South Sudan uh, to meet the Federal Reserve of, uh, of New York uh, relating to our transactions and issues relating to the financial industry. Uh, we also, in our part, uh, did some engagements with investors. Uh, among them was the Caltech that was announced uh, two days ago. Uh, the Caltech deal is on uh, uh, a long-term loan of $3 billion. Uh, 1.8 would be for budgetary support activities of the government during the transitional period. And 1.2 for uh, Petronas shares uh, that will be divided between the government and the Caltech 50-50. And this is a long-term loan. will be repaid after 13 years, uh, though it is still at the... Uh, the negotiation phase, we have not yet finalized. Uh, this loan process has to go through the Council of Ministers and also the Parliament before it gets approved and also some papers from our side. Then the deal will be said to have been sealed. Uh, however, uh, this is an, uh, the initial phase and we are looking forward to cooperating with Caltech and other companies in building uh, the resilience of our economy, uh, the entire ministry. Uh, from the duty minister to uh, under secretaries and all the workforce working tirelessly uh, to make sure all the payrolls from the spending agencies are printed in accordance to the 400 percent uh, increase uh, that was approved uh, in July uh, by the National Legislative Assembly. Uh, you know uh, it has to go through a process. All the spending agencies have to present uh, the adjusted payroll uh, to the Minister of Finance before we execute uh, the new physical budget. Uh, people should also understand that the budget was approved so late at the almost end of, uh, of, of July. So the delay has not been uh, because the Minister of Finance is unable to pay the salaries or is not willing to pay the salaries, but because it is a process, uh, we have to adjust all the payrolls all over. Uh, the public service, all the institutions, including the armed forces. And you know it is a huge uh, workforce that has to be done in a proper manner because this is a payroll fixed every month to be paid as prepared. So the delay happens because the budget was approved uh, lately and because we are working with all the spending agencies. Some did not even uh, submit their reports yet. So it is not our intention to delay the salaries. It is not that we, there is inability to pay the salaries, but we are doing this process in order to make sure everybody uh, received his or her salary uh, next time on time as, as appropriated by the law. I had an opportunity to meet with the Montran Corporation, uh, the company we have awarded to come and uh, implement the national payment system for the country. We had a very good meeting and they are coming to start. Hopefully by February next year we'll, we'll go live so that we're able to control the payments that are going out and coming in of the country. Uh, this is what I wanted to ask.